Welcome back, my consular friends. It's time to explain to our clients what hepatitis C testing involves. Make sure he or she perfectly understand how it works. Let's go. Hi, how are you? I'm okay, thanks. Do you feel you understood well what hepatitis C infection is? Yes, you explained it well. Hepatitis C is a viral infection of the liver and can cause liver damage. I understood as well that most people do not know if they are infected. True. The problem encountered by people with chronic hepatitis C is they often don't have symptoms and they don't know that they are infected. Over time, chronic hepatitis C can lead to serious liver problems, including liver damage, cirrhosis, liver failure, or liver cancer. But another thing is important to understand. Around 20% of the people who get infected with hepatitis C are able to get rid of the virus within six months after this infection. They do not develop chronic infection. The over 80% develop a chronic or lifelong infection. Well, in any case, the only way for me to know if I have hepatitis C is to get tested, right? I've never done that test. Being tested for hepatitis C is simple. I'm going to use a rapid test. Whatever the result, it will remain confidential. If you wish to. However, it would be very beneficial for you to share the result with a friend or family member if you want. We'll talk about this again. The test that I propose to you can measure only if the body has met the virus by measuring HCV antibodies. In fact, if your body met the virus, you produce antibodies. However, the test cannot measure if you still have the virus in your body or if you are among those people who eliminated the virus. So how can I know if I still have the virus then? To know if the body has been able to eliminate the virus, Another confirmatory test is necessary. The second test is called a viral load test, usually done by PCR technique, which aims at measuring the quantity of virus in the blood. And can I have that test if my rapid test is positive? Is it expensive? Unfortunately, yes. It's expensive because we need a specialized laboratory for it. And in some countries, it's not very easily accessible. Oh, I hope I don't have to do this second follow-up test. L let's do the rapid antibody test first. I do hope the same for you. Okay, I will perform the test and you will need to wait 30 minutes outside before I call you in again in order to share the results with you. <laughs> 